Good morning, student. In the last period of SST, we have started the second lesson that is our natural and cultural heritage. What is meant by natural heritage? Yes, a natural heritage comprises the environment that surrounds us. It includes the unique animals, birds, plants, forest, mountains, river, valleys and other natural features which found in the country. And what is the cultural heritage? Yes, cultural heritage means our traditional style of architecture, places of worship, inscriptions, pottery, coins, dance, drama, music and paintings comprises our cultural heritage. Even the literature, languages, food habits, dressing styles, housing, folklore, festivals and other such practices also form a part of our cultural heritage. Now, in the natural heritage, we saw the architecture. Hmm? Architecture means the style of making and constructing the building. In the olden or ancient days, the way of living, the style of constructing the historical monuments, these all things we saw in the architecture. Then we saw the paintings and what does it represent? It may be cave painting, it may be wall painting, isn't it? Yes, and then we saw the dances also. There are two types of dances, classical dance, folk dance and tribal dance. With this we saw the famous dancers also. Now, let us continue with the music. See here, just like dance, music in India too is of classical and folk style. How the dances are there? Dances also are of two types. First one classical dance and the folk dance. So same like that, music is also of two types. Classical music and folk music. Okay. So the classical music is further divided into two types. They are Karnatak and Hindustani music. Hindustani music developed in the northern part of India while Karnataka music developed in the southern part of India. Some of the famous vocal maestros of India are Pandit Jasraj, Bhimsen Joshi and M.S. Subbulakshmi. These are the famous classical singers we can say. So, there are two types of music that is classical and folk and again classical music is also divided into two types that is Karnatak music and Hindustani music. So, the Hindustani music is developed in the northern part of India and Karnatak music is developed in the southern part of India and Pandit Jasraj, Bhimsen Joshi and M.S. Subbu Lakshmi these are the examples of famous vocal maestros of India. Other celebrated musicians known for playing classical musical instruments include Pandit Ravi Shankar for sitar, Pandit Hari Prasad Saurasiya for flute, Ustad Bismillah Khan for shehnai, Pandit Shiv Kumar Sharma for santur, and Ustad Amjad Ali Khan for sarod, Ustad Jhakir Hussain for tabla. So these are some examples of famous persons in classical musical instrument. Got it? Now here is one activity. The instruments are given. We have to find out what is the name of this instrument. The first one is? Yes, it is Shehnai. Second one is? Tabla. And third one is flute. Yes. Now student tell me the famous persons according to this. Yes, the Shehnai. Ustad Bismillah Khan is the famous person for this. Tabla, 
झाकीर हुसेन फ्लूट पंडित हरिप्रसाद चौरसिया येस नाउ वील सी द लिटरेचर एंड द डिफरंट लँग्वेजेस ऑफ द इंडिया लिटरेचर मीन्स ऍक्च्युली इट्स अ बुक्स इट्स अ बुक्स इंडिया हॅज अ रिच कलेक्शन ऑफ लिटरेचर दॅट इज बुक्स दॅट इन्क्लूड्स बोथ रिलिजियस अँड नॉन रिलिजियस लिटरेचर रिलिजियस मीन्स विच आर रिलेटेड टू अवर रिलिजन अँड नॉन रिलिजियस मीन्स अपार्ट फ्रॉम दिस फॉर एक्झाम्पल स्टोरीज ड्रामा एटसेट्रा सो द रिलिजियस लिटरेचर इन्क्लूड्स बुक्स लाईक द वेदास द पुराणास रामायण महाभारत अँड द भगवद्गीता नावेडेज वी कॅन सी द रामायण अँड महाभारत ऑन द टेलिव्हिजन ऑल्सो अँड नॉन रिलिजियस लिटरेचर इन्क्लूड्स पोएम्स स्टोरीज ड्रामास एटसेट्रा रिटन बाय द फेमस रायटर्स डू यू नो देर आर ट्वेंटी टू लँग्वेजेस रेकग्नाइज बाय द कॉन्स्टिट्युशन ऑफ इंडिया हाऊ मेनी लँग्वेजेस आर देअर ट्वेंटी टू लँग्वेजेस अँड हिंदी इज द ऑफिशियल लँग्वेज ऑफ इंडिया संस्कृत अँड तमिळ आर टू ऑफ द ओल्डेस्ट लँग्वेजेस ऑफ द वर्ल्ड मोस्ट ऑफ द इंडियन लँग्वेजेस आर रिटन अँड रीड फ्रॉम लेफ्ट टू राईट हाव एव्हर उर्दू कश्मीरी अँड सिंधी आर रिटन अँड रीड फ्रॉम राईट टू लेफ्ट फॉर एक्झाम्पल नाव वी आर रिडिंग दिस सेंटेन्स फ्रॉम लेफ्ट टू राईट लाईक दिस बट उर्दू कश्मीरी अँड सिंधी दीज आर द लँग्वेजेस दॅट आर रिटन अँड रीड फ्रॉम राईट टू लेफ्ट लाईक दिस ओके नाव द नेक्स्ट पॉइंट इज फेस्टिवल्स डू यू नो इंडिया इज अ व्हेरी रिच ऑर व्हेरी फेमस फॉर द डिफरंट फेस्टिवल्स on for we that we are celebrating on the different different occasions yes india is a land of festivals they mark days of religious agricultural national importance some religious festivals celebrated in india are holi diwali dashera durga puja it means navratri ganesh chaturthi janmashtami rakshabandhan guru purab eid muharram mahavir jayanti buddha purnima and christmas so the, these are the festivals which are related to some religion now basant panchami baisakhi onam pongal are some harvest festival which are related to the agriculture and independence day republic day gandhi jayanti these are our national festivals means all nation are celebrating these festival yes now other cultural practices see some other cultural practices of our country are described below first one is dresses yes according to their different different tradition the people those who are living over there they are wearing the different dress styles tradition traditional indian clothes are a part of our rich cultural heritage these vary from state to state yes according to the states the dresses also changing saree and salwar kameez are popular dresses among women in state like gujarat rajasthan and haryana women wear ghagra choli in towns and cities both men and women wear shirts and trousers traditionally men wear dhoti kurta or kurta pyjama men in south wear lungi in some parts of the country men also wear turban on their heads okay so these are the different traditional dress styles of the people now the next is cuisine what is meant by cuisine cuisine means different food preparation styles in the different states different food preparation styles like punjabi mughlai kashmiri south indians etc are available in india rajma chawal chole bhature and shahi paneer are popular in north india 
फिश करी एंड राइस आर इटन इन द ईस्टर्न स्टेट्स एंड दाल बाटी चूरमा इज एन्जॉयड बाय पीपल इन राजस्थान गुजरात इज नोन फॉर ढोकला ठेपला एंड खांडवी एंड सांबार इडली एंड डोसा आर पॉप्युलर इन साउथ इंडिया मीन्स जस्ट लाइक ड्रेसेस द डिफरंट फूड प्रिपरेशन स्टाइल्स आर ऑल्सो चेंज अकॉर्डिंग टू द स्टेट नेक्स्ट इज हैंडीक्राफ्ट एंड एम्ब्रॉयडरी हैंडीक्राफ्ट आर द हैंडमेड डेकोरेटिव आइटम्स टेराकोटा वर्क बिदरी वर्क बैम्बू एंड केन वर्क आर सम एग्जाम्पल ऑफ हैंडीक्राफ्ट ऑफ इंडिया फुलकारी कांथा चिकन करी एंड जरदोजी आर पॉप्युलर टाइप्स ऑफ एम्ब्रॉयडरी डन इन डिफरंट पार्ट ऑफ द कंट्री एम्ब्रॉयडरी मीन्स विच वी विच वी आर डूइंग ऑन द क्लोथ्स और द सारीज येस वी आर इंडियन्स शुड बी प्राउड ऑफ अवर डायवर्स कल्चर एंड हेरिटेज Every citizen should respect it and make efforts to preserve it so that it can be passed on to the future generations. So, in this way, we have completed the second lesson of the SST that is our cultural and natural heritage. In the next period, we will revise this lesson and go with the exercise or the question answers which are given below this lesson. Okay? Thank you.